Hi, good evening everybody and welcome to my channel. My name is Angie and today I am going to do a post unboxing. Yes, I did say post because I received this awesome box from my friend Lisa and I received it yesterday and she and I did a video chat and she said, how would you like to open your box? And I said, you know what? I don't want to open it because I want to do a video and the box is inspiring me to do the video. And she's like, you can still do the video. <laughs> and I'm like, hey, you know what? She's giving me a gift. Why not? So, so Lisa and I, we love vintage accessories. We're talking hats, scarves, purses, brooches, jewelry, everything and anything that's a vintage accessory. And so she and I met on a Facebook group called Vintage Fashion Accessory Show and Tell. Um, we call it VFAST. And we've been friends for over a year now. And we've exchanged a couple of boxes here and there. And so since we both started YouTube channels, we thought, why not unbox our vintage items in a YouTube video. But like I said, I already opened my box, so I'm just here to show it to you guys right now. So thank you for joining me while I show you my vintage accessories from Lisa Michelle. So first up, she gave me a card and I'm not gonna read the card to you, but I will show you the outside of the card and it's so cute. Them. They're just kind of hanging around. Oh, like I said, they're hanging around. <laughs> Whether they're upside down or right side up or what, they're hanging around. And then Lisa always gives me coasters from Bose Brewing Company. Actually, You know, Lisa, I think I need to ask you about this because I always thought them, they were from the same um, brewing company. But this one, there's one that says Art Brewing, which is this one. This is so cool. Not only does it have shoes, accessories, but it also has cars. And if you can look closely, there's a VW bus. And this says a lot because I love shoes. I love cars and I especially love that VW bus in the background because I have a VW bus. So it's really cool. This one says Merit Brewing and this is a light bulb and I love it because we do have ideas, especially the video content that we want to work on together. This one says Grain and Grit. Look at that chick with her special leaves right there, right? Okay, and then the last one, this is cool. And this one's a tractor and this one is from Bose Brewing Company. And there it is. So there are all four of my coasters and I love these. They're pieces of art and I do use these. I have coasters all over my place so i gotta say i'm not too sure if i'm gonna put anything on this one though because uh, look how cool it is <laughs> so those are my coasters next up lisa sent me these two fantastic books i'm gonna tell you these books are fantastic i skimmed through them i haven't had a chance to really look at them deeply but here they are. One is Style Me Vintage for accessories and the other one is Style Me Vintage for tea parties. I love a good tea party and I love wearing accessories to the tea party. So these are fantastic. I'm excited. I do want to let all of you know that when I do receive books, particularly about accessories, and it's not just me, me and my vintage girlfriends, we will go through these books and if we find things that we like in these books, we will go on to Etsy, eBay, Poshmark, Mercari, and any other online vintage shopping website. 
and we will seek out these items. So we use them as catalogs. Yes. I have a lot of reference books <laughs> for vintage accessories. So there's another catalog for me. Thank you, Lisa. And I can't wait to check out this tea party book because who can use more tea party ideas, right? Thank you. Okay, so next up I have this really cool tapestry handbag with this handle. And the handle has tapestry all over it as well. This is so fantastic. I love all the colors. I can wear it with a lot of outfits. In fact, there's some green in here that goes with my green dress. Although I like to say that all handbags are unique. This one has an amazing feature because when I opened it, I thought, oh, is there another handbag inside here? What is this? No, it looks like another handbag in there and it pulls out like one, but it's attached to the inside of this bag. So there's this amazing clutch feature inside of this handbag but really it's like a pocket another pocket i love pockets especially when one looks like a clutch inside of a purse <laughs> it's a beautiful bag look at this i love it boom tapestry colorful awesome love it Speaking of colorful, beautiful things, Lisa sent me this beautiful robe. Looks, it's a kimono style. Look at this print. I love this print and it fits me perfectly. Um, I really love the peacock feathers on here. These colors are just so fantastic. Look at these sleeves but it fits me perfectly and I love it. It does come with a belt too. So oh, I love it so much. These mm, such a great box, Lisa. Mwah, thank you. But I still have more. I'm not done yet. Okay. So I love vintage aprons. Um, I, you know what? I don't even know why I never loved aprons before. They're just, great they're extra pockets and then when i'm washing my hands and i need a towel and i don't have one handy the apron is on me so it works as a towel it has pockets so i can put things in my pockets and i just love them so lisa sent me this beautiful apron and if i had material like this on a dress i would wear the dress but look at this Pink flowers, green leaves, brown, and the white lace, and then also the cute pocket with the cute pink ribbon. I love it. That's it. Just love it. Thank you. <sighs> okay. Yes, I still have more because Lisa packs this box with wonderful goodies. So many wonderful goodies. So she even puts homemade goodies in here too. So her mom is very talented. And in my last box, Lisa gave me jewelry that her mom made. She gave me two necklaces, a black one and a green one. And I believe... The, the shape of the gems on here may be different, but the color green still is the same color, I believe. And so I can wear these with the necklace that she gave to me. I love dangly earrings. So here are the earrings. And then this is a bracelet. These are so fun. And I love how the gems that you can see like blue and green and so pretty. So these were made by her mom. So I love it. And she gave me many brooches. This particular brooch was one of her grandmother's pieces. And it's a 
possibility it also could have been her grandma great grandmothers as well and it's a rooster and look at him he's got these different colored gems all over him and he's so fabulous look at that and i'm gonna start putting my brooches on so you're gonna see my dress full of brooches and I can't guarantee that they're going to be all in the right direction. But hey, you know, it doesn't matter. Just put a brooch on. It kind of reminds me of going to Disneyland and filling my lanyard up with Disney pins. <laughs> Except I'm going to do vintage tonight. So there's my rooster. Next up, I have a really cool cloisonne brooch. I love these. These remind me of the 80s. When I first, my first set of clothes and earrings was from the 80s. Look how pretty that flower is. I love it. So I have a small collection of clothes and I can't wait to put this with everything. I have a couple of pairs of earrings, um, a pendant, and oh, I have a couple bracelets too. So here I go. I'm going to put this one on. This one matches my dress very well. And I'm so excited. I just hope I don't stick myself while I'm doing this. Okay. That's my other brooch. Next up, I have this other beautiful brooch. And it has a blue, like a peach purple and green it's so beautiful look at all these colors so amazing and this one's going on my clothes too do any of you collect vintage accessories what are your favorites purses are my favorite but i gotta tell you i love all kinds of accessories you know brooches are so fun they could change the look of your outfit in an instant. And they're just really fun to wear. I have a bunch of them. Look at that. This green dress is working for all these brooches, by the way. Hm. I picked a good dress to wear tonight. <laughs> Next up is, so one of my favorite pastimes is fishing. And Lisa found this fishing brooch for me. I have to say, too. What's really cool is that I've always wanted to find brooches that relate to whatever activity I enjoy. And this is one of my favorite fishing brooches. And I love brooches that have movement like this. So look at that. It's got the little basket for the fish and also the net to catch the fish and then the little fish on the bottom. It's really cool. I did send Lisa a brooch um, with a theme that she loves. You know, she loves nautical themes, but she also loves cats. And the brooch I sent to her has a sailboat with a cat on it. And on the bottom, some dangly <laughs> fish. It's kind of, uh, it's fun, a little morbid, but hey, you know what? It's kind of funky. I like kind of funky stuff and she loved it too. So it worked out well. All right. So I'm putting this on right now. Okay. There's my little one with the fish, the little dangly fish. So I have a rooster, a fish. I have my clothes and a and I have this colorful floral brooch. And the next up brooch I have is, oh my gosh, I didn't even realize this last night. But not only this a brooch, this is also a pendant. Okay, so, oh my gosh, this is so fantastic. Okay, so here's the bicycle. And by the way, I love brooches that have anything to do with transportation. You could send me a brooch with 
a bicycle, a car, a train, a cruise ship, an airplane. I have a great collection of airplane brooches. Um, this one, is, you can see the, there it is on the top for where the necklace goes. Oh, I'm like so excited. <laughs> I can wear this as a necklace. Okay, but it is also a brooch. You can see the pin on the back. So I'm going to go ahead and put this, the brooch part on. Like my gosh, let's see how high I can get this. It's kind of hard to see this way. <laughs> too. Oh, I did that successfully. Okay. Look at my collar. <laughs> All right. And the last cool, awesome pin that I have from Lisa, and this is great because it's very holiday, Christmassy. I love it. It's green, red, and white. And it's a stick pin. And I love stick pins. Stick pins you can wear on your clothes. You can put them on a hat. They're very cool. I love them. And... I haven't done this yet, but what I want to do is because Lisa has sent me a bunch of stick pins and they're also beautiful. I want to make some sort of collage either on my clothes or on my hat. I have to experiment with it. Gosh, it's so pretty. Okay. Let's see where I'm going to get this one without hurting myself. All right. Let me just stick it up here. There we go. Okay. All right, everybody. So here are all my beautiful brooches from Lisa. I did pretty good. Thank goodness I didn't stick myself. Otherwise, you would have heard me scream on this sucker. Anyway, so that's my beautiful box from my beautiful vintage friend, Lisa Michelle. And I will link her YouTube channel below so you can all check out her content. She does videos on um, vintage outfits and accessories. And then she also does unboxing um, like gifts that I've sent to her and um, Redbird Vintage unboxings um, and all sorts of fun content. So I hope you follow her as well. I want to thank all of you who are my subscribers. Um, thank you so much for watching my videos. Thank you so much for subscribing and liking and commenting. I really, really appreciate it. I do this for fun and just to read all your information or even just seeing my likes and how many subscribers are. I have to admit, I think it's really, really cool. So I have 15 subscribers and I want to thank all of you so much. And if you're new to my channel, hey, please become a subscriber. I like to put up fun things. Um, cause we need fun things during these times, right? Anyway, if there's anything else you'd like me to create a video on, please comment below. We'll see what I can do about that. Have a great evening. Good night.